Monday morning marked the second staff meeting for the Immigration Department. The first was with staff at the VC Bird International Airport on Sunday. The Honorable E.P. Chet Green said the meeting was to reassure staff of the government's support to the officers amidst the threat posed by COVID-19. It was also to give the Central Board of Health an opportunity to provide practical training for staff. The etiquettes, um, sneezing, coughing, hand washing, um, things which we take very, for granted very often, but which we have, through the arrival of Corona, come to place a premium on. With immigration being the first line of contact for those entering the country, Minister Green says efforts continue to ensure all staffers are provided with critical information. Officers who have direct contact with those entering the country, especially at the seaport, will be given the necessary protective gear and measures are put in place to screen all arriving passengers. Gloves, um, gloves and masks in some areas. Um, we do this, of, of course, as added measure of security and safety. And I must add comfort for the officers in, um, involved. Um, the international authorities do not think that those are necessarily you know, measures that need to be implemented. But uh, we also want to adapt and, and make changes to international standards to satisfy local um, requirements. In the case where there is a glass barrier protecting the immigration officer, masks will not be required. We also asked the minister whether consideration will be given to closing the country's borders amidst the spread of COVID-19. As we keep the borders open, we have to consequently, or correspondingly rather, make decisions to ensure that the, 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 you know, the, the entry of the virus into the country is also um, you know, dealt with or being dealt with. Uh, it is not an easy equation. I want to remind us that we're balancing two factors here. We're balancing the health factor with and against the economic factor. He then used the opportunity to express his appreciation to the immigration officers. To thank every immigration officer who amidst the global threat of corona continue to man their respective stations, protecting Antiguan Barbados image and our borders at the same time. Kim Emanuel Baird, reporting for ABS News.